I will be the first to admit that I am always on my phone. I spend way too much on my phone, way too much time on my computer, watching TV, doing nothing, wasting time, wasting, wasting my cells. If I do it, other grown-ups do it too. I mean, you can see, you walk outside, you walk in a store, and at least half of the public has their noses in their phones. Our children are doing the same thing. Huh. Yeah. We depend on our TV, our games, yeah. pads, our mommy and daddy's phones. Yeah. Yeah. To play our games. You're four. Yeah. I was four in 1992. Back then, we didn't have, I mean, we had computers, but they didn't look like this. They were huge. The screen itself was like a box. And then the computer part was another big box that went underneath that. And that was our computer. Our TVs, you know how we have like 500 TV, or like channels? Yeah. We didn't have that back then. We had maybe a hundred at most. And that was if you paid for expensive cable. Yeah. Now should we show them after this? So, hold on minutes. I believe that us as adults, parents, aunts, uncles, brothers, sisters, grandparents, we should interact with our kids. We should do crafts, play board games, keep them away from the electronics. We, me and Jalen here, my niece, are going to decorate a visor. I believe when children are able to build something and they have something to look at and hold, it gives them a sense of pride and it helps with their confidence as well as their self-esteem because they did it. They started a project, they finished a project, they get to keep that project. So, like I said, we're going to decorate a visor. So we went to AC Moore's local craft store and we found these foam visors, one for you, one for me. We, we have, have some little stickers. We always have stickers. to take these off, but we don't know, but okay. kids don't know how. I'll take the tag off in just a minute. And then we have letters, stickers, just so we can decorate our visors. Once we get done decorating, she will have a visor that she can wear and Lizzie will have one that she can wear. So That's how my name starts. I know, it's a J. So, here. I'm going to open up this. Okay, if I can figure it out. This, all we have to do is like this. Yeah, I just got to get the sticker out first. Yeah. So, here's your visor. Let me see if I can. Ooh, I'm no good at this. Okay, there's your visor. Here's your J. So you just, you know how to peel your stickers off, right? Yeah. Okay. You just got to be super careful because they're letters and stuff. They're little stones. Yeah. Careful. I can't get that little piece. Can't get that little piece. Yeah, because we don't want to rip it. There we go. Now you put it wherever you want it to go on your hat. Oops, it's sticking to my finger. I'm sorry. Alright, and then we have just a little bag of stickers. Now you choose what you like. We have these little fairies and we have I unicorns. Like, I like we have gnomies. I want you want one of those? We have pretty flowers um. and a turtle. Hey, there's a hedgehog. Look at the hedgehog. <laughs> That's cute. Should we and Lizzie get them? We can also, I have markers right here. Yeah. You can draw and color and do whatever you like. Yeah. So. Like me and Lizzie get the turtle and everything. Right. So Wait, now. I got my, I got my stuff. We okay. are going to decorate our hats. Yeah. And see how we do. 
like Lizzie's because it's little. Okay. This is Lizzie's. This flower looks kind of funny. Yeah. Okay. 